complimentary from David Jones, please. David Jones. Yes, and I'd like to go back to, to Mr. David Davis, if I might. Um, my constituency has got a lot of care homes, uh, and uh, those care homes are largely, if not primarily, staffed uh, by workers from overseas, many of them from the Far East. Mm. Now, you touched on the cultural issue. Um, I, I suspect, uh, it may not be correct, but I suspect that it is cultural, maybe ethical and religious reasons that is precluding a lot of those uh, staff members from being vaccinated. Can it ever be right to require such staff members to, to be vaccinated? And um, also, could it ever be right for an employer to be allowed to discriminate against potential employees by uh, requiring them to have proof of vaccination uh, before they take up their jobs? Well, firstly, it's illegal uh, to require it at the moment. Um, it's, uh, sorry, it's illegal to require vaccination at the moment. Any, we, we are bound ourselves by and then the European uh, international uh, agreements to the uh, use of medical treatment. Medical treatment as it stands must only be for the benefit of the person it's administered to. Medical treatment must not be administered for, for as it were, communal purposes. Otherwise, we'll all be, we'll all be get, uh, giving um, mandatory uh, blood transfusions. Uh, and so on. I give blood anyway, but you know, but, but it will be a requirement. You'd have requirements like that. So uh, that's that's against uh, both international and national laws. Um, the 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 answer, as I as I intimated to the previous questioner, is to solve the problem by the method which is legal and acceptable, which is to vaccinate the people who are at risk. Not uh, you know. And look, if I were running a care home, and I'm very pro vaccines. Uh, I would say to all my all my workers, I would like you to vaccinate in the interests of our son, in the interests of our clients, uh, but uh, but I couldn't force it, and I don't I don't foresee a way which we can force it. And if you tried to say it's now a requirement of your job, um, I don't think the courts would uphold it. 